Give up for John and Jojo. First of all, congratulations, finalists. Thank you. You made it. Yeah. No. Who'd have thunk it? Who'd have thunk it? Who'd have thunk it? Who'd have thunk it? How are you feeling? I am feeling on top of the world, exhausted. My body's falling <laughs> apart. My emotions are all over the place, but I am so happy. And you know, it's just it's just been. I can't believe it's been like, I've said it before, a fast train journey through beautiful scenery. Yeah. And it goes so quick you can't take it in. No. Whereas this week it feels like we're just at the top of the mountain now, looking around and we're having a great laugh. Just aren't enjoying we? the view. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah enjoying it feels like the it. view. Well, look, let's talk about Saturday night because that couple's choice was beautiful. And I know that it was such a special dance for you in particular. Um, we spoke last week about how emotional you were getting in yeah. rehearsals, the pair of you, actually. Mm -hmm. What was it actually like getting out there on Saturday night and doing it? Oh, it was it was weird. Like, before we started, when the when the VT was running and the voiceover came on, I was almost crying, wasn't I? And mm -hmm. Joe was just like, hold it in, babe, hold it in. And you know, it, felt, it felt so cathartic just to be able to do that, to dedicate that dance to the people who have helped us in our lives and, and just show a masculinity that isn't necessarily, you know, butch and like, come on, mate, and aggressive. It's just gentle and kind mm -hmm. and, and reliant on one another. Mm -hmm. It was really, really powerful and, yeah, just a great experience to, to do that. And I'm so grateful that we got to do it. No, and we were grateful that we got to witness it because it was beautiful. And so many people, I was looking online, so many people, it just really hit the mark with them. One in particular, actually, was Alexander uh, on Twitter. He said, I've never resonated with a dance on Strictly More. The story behind it, the words spoken, John and Jojo's dancing together is a long time coming. And like they said tonight, if I had seen them on primetime TV when I was younger, my life would have been so different. Aww. Jojo, I mean, for you, you've been part of the show now for years. To, to read a message like that, I know how important this partnership's been to you as yeah. well this year. Yeah. How does that make you feel as the pro? It makes me feel, I can't tell you, I, I can't, there's no words to describe it. And John, like, like John said, it's our lived experience. This is what we go through every single day. Yeah. But to have a platform like this on the biggest mm. <laughs> primetime television, yeah. to get to do what we do and tell our stories through dance, you can imagine how special that is to me. And I've been, I'm, I'm so grateful. But well, I can see the end. It, I can just see it in your faces, how genuine you are as well when, when we talk about subjects like this. And, and Saturday night as well, Craig even turned around and said, that dance was so technical, so technical. Yeah. But at the same time for you boys, it was actually an emotive piece. So mm. where does the line cross with what's going through your head with the emotions and the technicality, John? I think it was the emotion that drove the technicality. Like once we got the, because the, the, the choreographer, Lucas McFarlane, who did a beautiful oh, he's amazing, job, really, he's yeah. incredible because he based every single step on the emotion of the dance, they were intertwined, they were yeah. inextricable. And that really kind of guided us, didn't it? Like Absolutely. we knew that if we focused on each other and we looked at each other at the right point and listened to the lyrics of the song as well. And that's, that's the beautiful thing about contemporary, it's so lyrical. Yeah. It's not based on the beat necessarily, it's based on the words and the, and the and movement. It, and the movement, yeah. And it was just, it felt, when we finished it, it just felt like, well, we've sent that message out now. And you've done it. Now, I mean, as emotional as all of that is, I really want to talk about these shirts you're wearing. So let's talk about the jive, <laughs> shall we? I think it's time for a bit of ribbing, would you oh, think? Um, I mean, you actually got to hear what the judges were looking for ahead of the dance. Motsi wanted mm. John to, you know, just take the brakes off a little bit, Jojo. Mm -hmm. I mean, he did. D didn't he just? Mm, <laughs> didn't Tell he me you kept them tops. Oh, we no. have to. Oh, no, we have to. Oh, babe, don't Rob, worry. Um, Vicky will be giving us yeah, those after Vicky the show. Up. Thank right. you, Vicky. I'll be, uh, I'll be stopping her in the car park on the way home <laughs> on Saturday night. <laughs> I might pop down Saturday. Yeah. Yeah, I'm fighting for <laughs> it. <laughs> it's my size, babe. Oh, <laughs> it'd be swimming on me. Swimming. <laughs> I mean, the judges said that they loved it. Shirley yeah. said it simmered, mm. it bubbled, it and boiled. It, oh, Shirley. It boiled. <laughs> Shirley and Ballas, what are you like? It's the highest jive score of the series nice. as well. You both must be so pleased at that. Well, the thing is, like, I was nervous about that jive because we spent so much time on the couple's choice. Yeah. We probably spent, what, six or eight hours eight learning hours. the jive. Wow. Not a lot of time at all. But I think that actually did it a justice because it wasn't over-rehearsed. Mm. And because it wasn't over-rehearsed, and maybe I wasn't as confident with the steps, I knew that I had to sell it. Yeah. Taking in consideration what the judges had said in, in, the, in the feedback. I knew that we had to sell it, we had mm -hmm. to go for it, my body weight had to be forward. And also I just thought, you know, it's the semi-finals, you've got to just give it everything you've got. Well, you both did. 
Yeah. yeah. Unfortunately, I mean, there's only four of you left, so it's yeah. inevitable for someone, but you both ended up in the dance off. How did that feel being so close? I mean, we have Reese and Nancy here last night, yeah. and they're actually great. They're, they're on a good level. Yeah. They're like, you know, we did it. We got to the semis, yeah. gutted about the final. But what about you boys? Was, what was going through your mind? Were you like, we need to get through to this final? Uh, no, I was really calm, wasn't I? No, he was too calm. <laughs> I was, what were you fuming? You were like, come I on. I was finished. I was a mess. It was a hot mess. It was a hot mess. I was like, Johannes, whatever. It doesn't matter. We've got here. It, it doesn't matter. Yeah, you know. What will be, will be. But do you know what? Two dances this Saturday gone. Boys, that was nothing. Because in finale, three. Three. Uno, dos, tres dances. Let's talk about <laughs> your favorite dance. What are you going for? So we have chosen to do the Paso <gasps> Dog. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's the waves coming back. The waves coming back. Yes, it's Johnny. Yes, Johnny Depp. Johnny Depp's reappearing. The wave and the eyeliner. Oh, oh. The, it's all coming back. Oh. That, that was the dance that kind of pushed us that bit further. And the, the judges have harped on about that dance every week, haven't they? Well, you've got thirty nine. We got thirty nine in week three. I know. I know. It was so we'll be going for the forty this time round. Yeah. Well, yeah. you, no, yes, we are. He's, he's more bothered about the scores than me. I just can't wait to do it. <laughs> <laughs> you loved this one, though, didn't oh, you? Oh, this was amazing, this dance. And like, we've, we've, we've been running it today, haven't we? And we're yeah. working on technique. And it's just such a cracker. It's such a belting dance. And it's it's a dance because it's a characterization dance as well. You, ha you can just perform it. Like, it's not John, it's Jack Sparrow. Yeah. So, you know, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just give it all I've got this week and I'm going to be an aggressive dirty little pirate oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, happy Saturday to you um, let's talk about judges what oh, have they chosen for oh. the pair of you Jojo they have chosen our beautiful Ramba <gasps> and you know what I was when we found it I was like oh John was like this is perfect and I was like no, see I love actually, this one so much I know Me too. it was one of yeah that was the sensitivity the fact that he's leading the entire dance I get why the judges chose it. Yeah. You know something? And we didn't we didn't get we got great scores. Like I shouldn't say that. We got an eight, score. nine, ten, ten. Yeah. Ten, eight, yeah. nine, nine, ten. Yes. Eight, eight, nine, ten. Yes. Eight, eight, nine, ten. yes. Two eights, one nine, and a ten. All right, Carol Vorderman. <laughs> <laughs> I love a vowel play. <laughs> so no, we can definitely improve. And that's the beauty about it, my darling. I need to talk about this final show dance because this is something. And this year, in a Strictly First, all three of our couples are going to be accompanied by the House Gospel Choir. Oh. Yes, I adore them. It's going to be amazing. I can reveal, and I've heard them sing this, it's amazing, you are going to be performing to this. I mean, this is just what oh. dreams are made this of. This is an anthem. This is a chia it's a Chihuahua now. Oh, no. On a Chihuahua's day. <laughs> it really is. I mean, the House Gospel Choir, I adore. They oh. are so amazing. But to get to sing that song with you guys dancing, Jojo, talk to me about the show dance. Do not disappoint me. I know okay. where you live. You, you, let me say something. <laughs> <laughs> Jason Gilkerson did not hold back no. with Good. this one. No. You yes. know, and he made sure that he plays to John's strengths, which is something that I adore. He's been watching our journey throughout the entire series, so he's not missed a thing. We've got our Argentine, we've got Lyft, we've Charleston. got Charleston, we've got... Stop it. It's just everything in the pot. It's busier. And we're going to be Sev. It's busier than a Destiny's Child medley. <laughs> no! <laughs> it really is busy. And I cannot wait to see what you bring to the final on Saturday night. Thank you. We're all you. behind you, absolutely 100%. It is John and Jojo! Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and next time, if you're going in my wardrobe, ask permission. <laughs> uh, now, we have got...